Hey everyone, I'm Joe. I'm Taryn. I'm Bart. And I'm Gio. And you're watching Ask the Feels. And today we have a question from Beans M. Is being a virgin and pretty much sexually inexperienced a turn off for a guy that's not a virgin? Ah, short and sweet. Yeah, that's a guy question. I'm curious to hear that. And the that. answer is short and sweet. No. Oh, really? I think <laughs> guys want to have sex. No matter what. That's pretty much like the big blanket rule. <laughs> I know. And then underneath it, yeah, there's a bunch of like sub articles and stuff, but who really gives a fuck? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I think when the guy approaches a girl, depending on what her experience is, that's what the guy, my, the guy's mentality changes. So if the girl's a virgin, I think guys will go into it, I'm gonna obliterate the pussy and then <laughs> make her bleed all over the place. Ew. Scream her brains out. I don't even know if that's physically possible, but I think inside that's what guys think. No. Really? So you guys get off on like the whole No, it, it, some some guys are like they they actually want a girl that's virgin, so then like they're the first one. So then it's a preference then. I am ingrained in her memory, you I, know? I do know some guys that, that or like this one situation where a guy met a girl and he like wanted to take her home and then found out she was a virgin and he didn't like her enough to have to deal with any potential like emotional drama. Oh, oh. that's different though. I think if the guy's really into you, it won't matter right. at all. Yeah, you know what right. I mean? It's actually it's actually a good way to find out if the guy doesn't is into you because right. you know he will oh, wanna yeah. he'll he'll, he'll treat you more he'll be more sensitive mm -hmm. and take his time a little bit more once he knows that. You haven't been there <laughs> Unless yet. you're with Bart, you're a virgin, I'm a obliterate. Because <laughs> <laughs> do girls normally get super emotionally attached? A lot of girls do. Yeah. Even even non-virgins oh, girls get emotionally attached. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so they just get attached regardless then. But then virgins are extra, or I'm stereotypically, uh, they're extra. Or also like if it's not the ideal sexual experience for the for the virgin girl, she might start crying, which is what I did. <laughs> Please do tell. Yeah. Please Please this tell. sucks. This isn't enjoyable. Like you during? cried during? Yeah, the first time. So that was I had the sex. guy like, damn, do I suck that bad? I don't think he knew it. He just kept doing. going. No, oh, no, shit. he was he was not a virgin. He was very sweet and took his time because he knew I was a virgin. Like you know, we dated for a little bit. And then, <laughs> so but then I was like, man, this doesn't feel good at all. This is awful. So you were just during, crying. Sometimes the first time for girls is yeah. not pleasurable. Yeah. When you're so when you were crying, like you were just crying. I just was. He was on top of me, so I was like, he saw all just tears like streaming down. Like, he was like, yes, I'm obliterating that. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I would like of the get tears. Soft. I'm fine. I'm fine. Damn. So you were crying not because of the pain, just because you were disappointed. Uh, both. It was probably a mixture of both. You know. <laughs> Fuck. Well, you that sucks so bad. traumatizing for the guy. I no. Don't he, no, I don't think he knew. You I think I played know. it off. I was oh. just like, oh, it just hurts. A little bit. Uh, oh, I made him feel better. He's like, yeah. It hurt. <laughs> I don't know. Wow. <laughs> oh, fuck. Dang. But uh, you know, it's not always gonna be great for a girl the first time around. It's like as long as the guy knows that. Yeah, and I don't think guys should care. I mean, but so ever. so I guess a hypothetical. But flip this around. How would you feel? If what? If if you were dating a guy and you found out he was. A I virgin. would. I would. And you were not I a virgin. I wouldn't like it. Like so you it. want a slut in your life. Um, not a slut. Oh, well, At least okay. Disease ridden, well, well, AIDS. Let me, let, me take that. let me take it back then. So yeah. let's say he's a virgin, yeah. but then like if we foreplay and he seems like the type that just is like super passionate and emotional about stuff, then I'm like, dude, I'm down. Cause those are like the easy moldable kind. Yeah. But if he's super rigid and like clumsy and like sweaty palms and just gross. <laughs> you, <laughs> sweaty you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> yeah, then I'm like, I don't know. Then I'm just like, Fish and shake, ready? What is that? This is how some guys have oh, sex. Oh, no. <laughs> this is how some guys Oh, have sex. Wow. <laughs> yeah, one of the. Yeah, it's like a dead thing. <laughs> that's what I don't want, and that's what I feel really. They're all like limpy and shit. No you know? way. Like, yeah, yeah. So if it's like that, then I don't want it. But yeah, if they, no. if they like have that passion and <laughs> fire, it's like know. fucking a slug. I have to admit, I mean, if I'm just being straight up, if I started dating guy now, as, you know, at my age. My experience level, you know. <laughs> You're I just, just like. God, that, I'm not man. a whore even. Guys. <laughs> no, I'm not a whore. I've just had a number of. I've had a number of serious relationships, but I would be, I would be turned off if a guy was a virgin. Damn. It would, it would, it would make me worried that there, would, that there would be this whole like, like you said, clumsy, awkward, trying to, and I don't want to teach someone and yeah what if they're it's not that they're inexperienced or they couldn't get any what if it was a moral thing that they're like well I want to save it till marriage but I'll do everything else also because there's a lot of girls like that me neither but there's a lot of girls like that and then there's this one girl I was talking to she's actually married now we're friends but um, she was like yeah like I'll, I'll I'll suck dick I'll do everything else but like I want it you know after marriage and I'm like oh interesting 
That is interesting. Uh, That's the Catholic schoolgirl sure. mentality. I'll do everything except for stick it in the vagina hole because Jesus knows that that's the, the no. <laughs> I don't buy it. I don't buy this it. This is okay I all totally, day. I totally that's respect to people's sexual, you know, preferences and waiting to waiting yeah. for marriage, but because that's not my you can't point, do it. Yeah. I, I, I don't know that I can be with someone that I can't you either. know, I mean. But now you people know that if someone shakes your hand like this, <laughs> then the sex, is bad. the sex is like this. But if someone shakes your hand like Fucking mm. crushes that shit. Then, no, no, that's how they shake your head. Then, I don't know about that one. Do you have any burning questions that you want to talk about in regards to sex, love, and relationships? I have a burning penis. If you have a burning penis, or a burning vagina, or a burning butthole, then make sure you go to askthefeels.com and we can talk about your burning butthole or any other burning hole that you have. Just submit your questions there and it'll be in the next video. Is it like a fire burning inside? <laughs>